What's up, baby? Hey, man, we we came up short tonight. You know, I I don't know what happened, to be honest. You know, I my timing was off, and I didn't throw my punches. I didn't, I didn't let my hands go like I supposed to. Sometimes we get like that, you know what I mean? But, you know, you live to see another fight. You live to see another moment. That's all that matter. Still full of happiness. I'm still full of joy. I'm still full of smiles. Sorry right, if I let anyone down. You know, but we'll be back, though. That's the good thing about it, you know. And, uh, man, I can't wait to get on this PJ to go back to my babies. I'm going to see her. Today is one of my, my daughter's birthday. Daddy love you so much, baby. I'll be home soon, though. But I thank you so much for the love and support that I've got in Riyadh and all my families, all my, my fans around the world. I thank you. I appreciate you so much. This is not the end. Um, we'll be back. Love, peace, God bless. You already know what it is, family. GMOG Sports TV, GMOG Media TV, Great Man of God Media TV, back with another one. Listen, man, Wilder, you got demolished. You got destroyed by Joseph Parker. You got dominated. You had nothing. You had absolutely nothing. I mean, <laughs> the right hand was nullified. Like, people know your game plan. If you got good feet, decent feet, decent feet, anybody can avoid that right hand. And Joseph Parker proved that with game that was sent to him from Tyson Fury. So when you guys like when you got when you have guys like that that can figure you out, and especially when a small niche circle of heavyweights, right, that can figure you out, it's it's a wrap, man. It's a wrap. Wilder stepped over dollars to pick up pennies by fighting Tyson Fury in a trilogy. He could have fought. Anthony Joshua for over $100 million three years ago. He fumbled the bag. I hear people talking about, well, you know, Wilder made over $150 million and took care of his family. <laughs> Fucking great. Fucking great. You know, he made lots of money. He's taking care of his family. And I think that was his objective anyway. His, his objective was to take care of his family, his daughter. Who had a who had an ailment, right? That's what you're supposed to do. So you're pointing out the obvious, but in order for you to separate yourself from the competition, man, you got to do something that's extraordinary. He is an ordinary fighter that has one weapon that can be easily dismantled, and that's his right hand. It's proven that when he steps up in competition to face some decent fighters. He is completely useless. It has proved that this past Saturday night against Joseph Parker. All right? So there is a reason why this guy's been so protected throughout the years because the matchmakers knew how inept, how useless, how limited Deontay Wilder is. Um, Wilder needs to retire, man. Like, you know, just stay retired, enjoy your family, enjoy your money. Uh, just, just, it seemed like you got all your faculties in order. Hopefully, I, I would think so. At least, at least a good 80% of your faculties are there. You do some highly questionable shit by twerking, um, in front of a bonfire, in front of a bonfire, listening to TLC's creep, creeping on the down low, which indicates that you are into bisexual or bi-curious activities. Hey, 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 the boy Michael out of Atlanta. Talking about you want to be impregnated and stuff like that. Super duper pause. Outside of that, you know, you have been, I would give you credit, you have been an entertaining fighter uh, because of your right hand, but you did that against pretty much inept competition. Competition was trash until you faced Tyson Fury. Like, and again, you did not want to fight Anthony Joshua while Anthony Joshua had the belt was the cash cow, not only in the division, but in boxing. Y'all could have made hundreds, hundreds, hundreds of millions of dollars by fighting a trilogy. Instead, you fumble a damn bag. Now, Anthony Joshua did his part. He won against Wallen and stopped him, broke his nose. I could see it in his eyes. There's something different about Joshua. I could see it when he, when he fought. There's something different, man. 
I don't know if it's the old AJ or not, but it's something definitely different for sure. Um, but Wilder, man, like, I, this, you need to retire, bro. You need to retire. Stay retired. I, I, enjoy the fruits of your labor while you can. And, um, you know, just do that, man. Don't be a delusional fighter. Don't be somebody out there still trying to act like they got it. Still trying to throw that right hand and you can't connect. Don't be one of those fighters, man. I, I just, I just, hopefully you have the right circle of uh, people around you. Shelly Finkel, your goddamn manager, everybody else around you can tell you, stay retired. You said you invested your money, you, like, looks like you did. Well, invest, use that money that you invested and retire and enjoy the fruits of your labor. All right? We don't need to see you in the ring. I don't want to see you in the ring at all, period. I don't want to see you. Because you can't fucking box. It's just that simple. You don't know the fundamentals of boxing. You can't box. This is not about this. This is, this is not. This is not called throw the right hand. This is not called that. You threw thirty nine punches the whole damn fight. Thirty nine punches that connected. Okay. That's fucking atrocious. It seems like it's a record. Breaking year for the least amount of punches landed in 2023. Like, it's crazy. In championship fight, well, in, in not, not only championship fights, but in fights in general. It's, it's been like a, a tremendous year about the amount of output punches landed. It's, it's crazy. But nonetheless, man, um, like I said, Wilder, retire. Enjoy the fruits of your labor. You were an entertaining fighter while it lasted, but people can figure you out just like that because you're very easy to figure out. All right, and just keep it just keep it a buck. Like you're not a true boxer; you're just a one trick pony, like people say that you were. You're a one trick pony, and when that when that trick don't work, that's all you got. You're just a useless fighter. Point blank and simple, man. A useless fighter. So. Those are my thoughts on that, family. Leave your comments down below. What do you guys think about Wilder? What do y'all think he should retire, fight again? Should he fight AJ, even though he just completely got dominated? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section, family. Until next time, signing out.